athlete Amarion Griffin is on the fast track to a free education. I want to be great. I got to. His strides for greatness on the track as well as the basketball court paying off during his last year at Cardinal Ritter. He's received 77 college acceptance letters and counting. I have received over $2.2 million in scholarships. First scholarship came in, I'm like, okay. Second scholarship, I'm like, that's not enough. I don't have enough money to pay for you to go to school. His mom, Kenyatta, would bring those $2 million opportunities to her son, no matter what it took. Every scholarship fair that was going on in St. Louis, I was there. Every application, I'm talking about 2 and 3 o'clock in the morning, we up filling it out. I just opened up all the letters and just laid it on my floor. I was like, Maria, you really doing this? Like, you really can go to school for free and not have your mom pay no money. You don't have to have your dad pay no money. It's a relief on me. I don't have to pull from my poor one. I don't have to borrow money. I don't have to work three, four jobs again. My son, education is paid for. This celebration almost did not happen in his freshman year. And we was always at the hospital. And Marion saw more hospital rooms than classrooms <laughs> after being diagnosed with a heart condition. The final diagnosis they gave him was what they call orthostatic hypotension. It's when your blood pressure drops, when you stand up, and his heart rate increased. Over the course of three years of sickness, Amarion's basketball teammates rallied by his side, praying for a recovery. I never forget the day he was not breathing. And I had to administer CPR on my own child. So like I couldn't walk, I couldn't stand up without passing out. I done lost 90 pounds. Do you pay the tuition? Do you pay your mortgage? Do you pay for his medication? Those are the three things you deal with every day. Thanks to the doctors at St. Louis Children's Hospital, those worries are gone. Amarion is happy, healthy, and headed to higher learning. Every day I'm pinching myself and saying, thank you, God. Taking off this fall to Kansas on a four-year full-ride scholarship. Keeping the 3.8 and above GPA since my freshman year, uh, even getting a high school diploma, not even just that, making it to C my senior year in high school in the city of St. Louis. That's black history it is.